What is up, how you all guys doing today? Got a terrible, terrible news. This news has been leaked a few weeks ago, but I'm really so much sorry. I'm late on this news right now. But if you're going to buy a Suzuki Wagon R, so I'm terribly, terribly sorry. You are unfortunately not going to buy the car because uh, Suzuki Pakistan has uh, canceled the booking of Suzuki Wagon R because the Wagon R was selling as hell. The bookings by day by day the Suzuki was getting from the Wagoner because of the success of Uber Kareem in Pakistan because it's a very fuel efficient car, it's a very reliable car, it's maintaining costs, anyone can maintain it without any hesitation, without any problems. Its spare parts are easily available, uh, its spare parts are easily uh, like inexpensive, inexpensive, okay, and the car resale value is so good and the car fuel average is good and the car don't doesn't eat so much fuel on ac while you are on a stoplight okay that's a cool thing about the car and it good it's good for the money because in 1 million or 1.2 million you're getting a cool car but here's the news okay but i think so that uh because the suzuki cultus it's not selling because that's the reason i think so that suzuki is canceling the orders for the wagoner because right now uh, if you don't know what is on most of you guys know that here in pakistan what is the meaning of on is a premium amount that you have to pay for the car if you want the car right that moment or you don't have to wait for like six months eight months or even one year you want like a right that moment you have to pay for suzuki wagoner like the car cost if everyone buys VXL, no one buys VXR. Even when in 2014 Suzuki launched uh, Wagoner, it came out with VX. Uh, VX means all a simple car, no power steering, no power windows, a uh, simple car, but uh, non painted front and back bumpers. VXR is basically with painted bumpers, simple car, but uh, it I think so VXR has the power steering and the VXL, uh, VXL is the fully loaded version mean it has the alloy wheels plate not the alloy rims uh, alloy wheel, um, wheels plating rim plates okay and it has um, power windows only for front or driver and passenger not for the back and it has front and back painted bumpers and it also has the power steering that's the reason that its uh, sale was going as high as hell and the on money the company was asking for this uh, like car this car costs in market the suzuki charges uh 11 lakhs 50 thousand to 12 lakh 50 thousand between uh, VXR and VXL if you want to buy these variants and the on money the Suzuki charges that is going from 150,000 rupees to 250,000 rupees mean 1 lakh 50,000 to 2 lakh 50,000 that's the premium amount of a Honda CT or on the Honda Civic bro like Suzuki is asking for this much on and I think so that the new Cultus is not a successor for a cult, uh, Suzuki because I think this price is so high, like the VXR base variant costs about like uh, 12,50,000 and the car is like piece of crap, I think so. And VXL costs uh, 14 lakhs and uh, VXL, uh, if you don't know that, so came, so the colors came out with the automatic transmission that costs 15 lakh 28,000 rupees. And I tested the car on the ring road, Lahore ring road, if you don't know what the meaning of that, it's a kind of highway. So I tested the car with the Suzuki officer sitting by next to me for like telling me what to do, what to not to do. I was testing the car. I just tested the car brakes from 100 to zero and that car exists with the ABS system, anti-lock braking system, and the car kept on slipping. The pavement of the road, the surface of the road was completely brand new. It was not resurfaced or it was not polished. The pavement of the road was completely brand new, brand new resurfaced the road. And still the car from 100 to zero, it kept on slipping. And the car was having knocking noises while in the first gear with AC and without AC. And I think so, and the airbag, I made a review and I, I made a 40 minutes of review on the 
to uh, Suzuki Cold Fest, you, I, I, I highly suggest you go check it out because no one has ever uploaded this much a kind of abusing review to to a car because the car is so bad. I, I highly suggest you before buying a to, uh, Suzuki Cold Fest, I highly suggest you go watch the video. I'm not advertising. I'm just helping you guys before buying a bad car because. It airbags can literally pop out just pushing uh, by your hand. I was just pushing my hand on the passenger side airbag, like the down the dashboard, and it was completely going down and down. And I had I heard some cracking sound. Like I said, okay, okay, it's not a good idea. And then I went back on to the trunk. The trunk was having coatings of you know like protein. The car was not completely painted, not like. Uh, not completely like constructed, well constructed, and the car was having a uh, rust all over the car trunk, and I think it's a bad thing because it's a brand new car, and you're getting this kind of quality. Okay, here's the news: Pakistuki is one of those companies that is doing exceptionally well in Pakistan. That is true. The company has sold a record number of cars and bikes in 2017. That also true. The latest news about the company is that it has forbidden its dealership to take further booking of all the popular Suzuki Wagon R. The order maker has issued a notice to its dealership telling them to haul the bookings of Wagon are starting from 1st February 2018. The suspension is only temporary and all previous orders will be honored and delivered accordingly. The internal circular does not state the reason behind the suspension for booking of booking. Arguably, there are two possible explanations why Suzuki Pakistan decided to halt Wagon R bookings. First is simply of numbers of orders of the company has already taken, it is possible that there is a huge backlog that Suzuki wants to clear first before taking any more orders. Wagonar was very popular last year and was sold in huge numbers. Still, it's been currently selling in huge numbers. The second reason could be that Park Suzuki is trying to divert potential customers from Wagonar to its other hats by Suzuki Cultus that I was talking about previously. It's a bad card, don't go for that. And buy a freaking Honda City that's cost only 16 lakhs, more like 70,000 or 60,000. But there's a significant price difference between both cars, and he, uh, this strategy to increase the sales of Cultus might not actually work. Both of these points are just assumption, and only Suzuki, Pakistan Suzuki knows the real reason behind the stoppage. We will get our readers' update as soon, and I will to you guys. And as always, guys, peace and bam.